Hey guys, it's Crazy Childs. One back with another video. This is the unboxing of the SH Figure Arts Yellow Ranger from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, otherwise known as Japan as Tiger Ranger from Kyoji Sentai Zero Ranger. Now, before I start, as always, make sure to like today's video if you like it and subscribe and stay to my channel. Now, unlike all the other Power Ranger Mighty Morphin SH Figure Arts, if you buy the American version, you're getting something completely different. If you buy the Japanese version, you're getting something completely different. What I mean by that is that besides the packaging, as you can clearly see the packaging, it's American Yellow Ranger. There's something different, as you can see what the figure is. It's actually the female version from the American Mighty Morphin from, from the American Power Ranger series. Because in case you don't know, in Zoo Ranger, the Tiger Ranger was actually male. Which, you, if you ever looked at Mighty Power Rangers in the Japanese footage, when they use the Zoo Ranger footage, you can clearly see that that's a guy in the suit instead of a male, instead of a female portraying it. But in Mighty Morphin, since Trini was a female, obviously, it was, they thought it would be better just to have the female mode for the figure. So for the first time ever, they decided to make an exclusive figure over here for the United States. It's technically exclusive, all it is just a female instead of a male version. But either way, this is technically the first time this ever happened in terms of Ed Chase figure arts. So we actually got lucky. So you're actually getting something exclusive if you buy the American version. In the Japanese version, you're actually getting the male. So now you actually have a choice. You either want the male version or the female version. If you buy the male, if you buy the female version, you get the American packaging. If you buy the male version, you get the Japanese packaging. Otherwise, in terms of accessories and hand parts, it's the exact same thing. The only difference is what figure you're getting or what person you're representing. So actually, that will ultimately decide if. You are basing it off the Mighty Morphin team or the Zoo Ranger team. It's completely up to you. You know, if you buy the Zoo Ranger figure, it's pretty much still representing the Mighty Morphin team. But that's a completely different story. Oh, well, let's look at the packaging, so I'm um, shall we? But before I do, let me get that out the way. There is a big difference if you buy American and Japanese version. American version, you get Trini. Japanese version, you get Boy. So, here we go. Looking at the box, it shows Yellow Ranger. And her, again, this is the female version, so she shows the female Yellow Rangers. Trini, looking at her, I'm, I actually like the yellow that they use for this for some reason. I don't know why I just do. It's just me, I guess. But regardless, as always, says, there's always that's figure new action figure series under Bandai X figure under the theme. It's, um, it's, how do we even expressing characters, especially who are in the humanoid actions? I know. I've been saying it forever. I still can't get it right. <laughs> Regardless, look at the box, Trini. On the back, the yellow, which I'm liking it. They're using the gray and yellow, and you know, some sign of her action movable. Her band says a figure articulation enables dynamic posing to recreate iconic Yellow Ranger action scenes. Molding a square purport to the favorite replicate case the Yellow Ranger has been achieved via Mastercraft to scale most attention to detail and option parts. A full array of option parts included. Including Yellow Ranger weapon accessories are included inside. They basically translated the Japanese box. <laughs> when you get that, doesn't really sound right over here in America. So before I unbox it, like I said before, the only difference actually there's no only difference. There's a big difference. If you buy the American version, you're getting Trini. If you buy the Japanese version, you're getting Boy. That's pretty much just cut set deals. So let's just unbox this thing, shall we? And also, if you bought it in order, you should have the final parts of the Power Blaster. If you bought Black Ranger, then Blue Ranger, then Yellow Ranger, you have the final parts of the Power Blaster. Granted, it doesn't matter which order you buy it. And I'm just saying, if you hit all three Rangers, you have the Power Blaster. And am I going to get it right this time? Probably not. Nope. So, wait. Are they actually, the hands are gonna actually going to stay in? Yes! The last Mighty Morphin Ranger. Eggs are actually standing together. Holy crap. There's Yellow Ranger is gonna stand it right there for a second. Of course she won't stand. Blue Ranger had no problem doing it, but the Yellow Ranger got to do a little bit more force. Come on, stand Trini. That makes me beg the question. There, there you go. Okay, she can stand like that. Get her weapons. Power daggers. The last weapon for the power blaster and her hand. Oops. 
I actually fell, almost fell. And there you go, that's pretty much the unboxing of the SH figure arts Yellow Ranger from Mighty Morphin Power Rangers. Otherwise known as Japan, it's Tiger Ranger from Kyrie Sentai the Ranger. Thank you for watching, and if you like today's video, hit the like button, comment down below, and subscribe and stay to my channel. As always, if you want to see Power Ranger, um, Super Sentai, Kamen Rider figure arts or anything toy related, check out my Instagram, which is also in the link in the description below. As always, this is Crazy Tales of One, signing off, and I will catch you guys later. See ya.